In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your Canon Selfie CP1500 photo printer. This photo printer comes with the charging cable. You also get ink cartridge, paper tray, manual, and paper, photo paper. So let's do the installation. Now the first step is to connect this with the power cable. So that's a complete setup. Plug in the power cable at this end. So once we plug in the power cable, press the power button. Select your language, so press OK. Next step is to install the selfie photo layout app. So that's quite handy. So we can just press OK for that. Now scan the QR code. So let's scan it. Go to the Epson.com. That is the selfie photo layout. Go to the Apple Store. Now we can open this app. Skip. Here we have to add this printer for the setup process. So we have installed the app. So press OK. And here we have to select our scanner. So click on the plus button on the top. Select CP1500. So we have already scanned it. So press OK. And press OK. And just scan it. Connecting to the printer for registration. Press OK. Join Wi Fi network CP. So click on the join. Printer is registered and it is connected with our smartphone. Now we can do the update. Yes. Click next. Agree with the terms and conditions and download. Download is complete. Press OK. Join with the printer. Press OK. Once it is done. We can see the main section of the app. Press OK on this screen as well. So it's updating. So do not turn off. So we have to wait for that. Press the power button to restart it. Next step is to load the paper and, rip and install the ink. So to install the ink, we have to open the side door that is here. So if you just open, open from here, and that's the ink cartridge. So take it out. These holes should be going inside, like this. So it's very easy to install. And we will here click. That's installed. Now close this section. Once you install the ink, you will see the main screen and it says select and print, selfie photo layout. Now next step is to load the photo paper. Photo paper goes in the front. So open this section. This is the photo paper tray. Now to load the paper, open this tray from here. And now you have to lift it up from this side and it will open the complete tray. Place the photo paper, the glossy side should be facing up. Place it back. And now we can install it here. So it just goes like this. And we have successfully prepared our printer for printing the photos. Now if you want you can just print with the SD card, you just have to install it here. Now go to your app, select and print. 
if you want to make any changes like layout you can do that so select from here now you can select if you want to print as a postcard or any other size and here we have the print finish like glossy and press ok select a photo recent so it will take you to the all the photos you have now select any photo press ok and then click on the print on the next page it will ask you to join so click join with the CP1500 press ok image is sent It's very interesting to see how it prints. So it prints in the four steps. print is done so here we can see the print quality is really great and the photo is very clear it's a very good photo printer for your home you can print a lot of photos the only thing is you have to buy the ink cartridge because the initial ink cartridge you get with the printer cannot print a lot of photos it may print up to four five or ten photos but if you want to print a lot you should be buying a new ink cartridge now in case you want to do more settings of your printer you can just go to the screen here we have the option menu now we can scroll click on the Wi-Fi settings click the settings again scroll down others scroll down select wireless router we are going to connect this printer with the home or office Wi-Fi network. Now it has few options. You can use the WPS connection or you can select the second option, find wireless routers. It will display the list of your Wi-Fi networks. Scroll down and select your Wi-Fi network. To enter it, click on the menu. We can enter the password using this keypad. With the menu, you can change it to uppercase, lowercase, alphabets, number. So I'm just going to enter the numbers. Once you enter the password, you just have to click on the finish and press OK. And press OK for next. So it will start the connection process. Printer is connected to the Wi-Fi and press OK again. Once you connect it with the Wi-Fi network, now you can start using it with other devices next step is to add this photo printer in any device for example I am just going to use in my smartphone and I want to print it wirelessly using Wi-Fi then I can go to the Canon print app now Canon print app is here you can download it from the app store so if you want to know the name that is Canon self that is the Canon print inkjet selfie here we have to click on the printer icon click on the add switch click register printer wait for your printer to appear so that is here selfie CP1500 select it instantly it will add up your printer you can see your printer icon now you can start printing wirelessly using your home Wi-Fi. so that's the complete setup of this printer with the different devices like iPhone Android phone and how to use it with the inbuilt Wi-Fi or with the home or office Wi-Fi 
so i hope you enjoy the video if you like it please subscribe and share thanks for watching